Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much to those who stay tuned with me. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Esther and I'm the founder of Authentic Worth Publishing. I will link my other YouTube channel in the description bar below as well. In today's video, I want to talk about two things. The first one is skincare and the second one, having a good skincare routine. Skincare is really important and I emphasize on this so much because as a woman, who went through drastic breakouts a few years ago. Now we're coming into the summer season. I'm sure the majority of us, if not all, desires to have really good skin. In a nutshell, I'll start with my first book, It's Time to Heal. So my first book, It's Time to Heal, which I published and wrote in 2016. I briefly spoke about my skincare journey at the time and what I encountered during university. Anytime you feel inadequate or out of place when it comes to your skin, don't be afraid to seek help. In 2016, I went to my GP and a dermatologist to see what was going on with my skin. And they weren't able to identify why my skin was breaking out. So alternatively, they recommended me to use Duac. Now, if you've seen my previous videos about my skincare routines, you will know that Duac has been my consistent night cream and I haven't changed at all. As I continued the journey of my healing process in my skin, to help people in particular to embrace their a confident face and to build that confident skin. One thing I had to realize that in order to cultivate confident skin, I needed to have a confident mindset. Now I say this because a lot of the times it's very easy to focus on how we look externally. Of course, our skin, our hair, our body shape, but we must realize at the same time that if you're not working on your internal your character, your attitude, your behavior, which does show it will have an impact on how you look externally and how people also perceive you to be. Now, one thing I always say, especially in this book, that if you want to heal, healing starts within. It is a journey that you must take and you can't forfeit the process. You can't just say you want a quick fix solution. Quick fix solutions on skincare doesn't work. It starts within. And when you can work on your internal being, you will really start to see things gradually progress and develop and work in your favor. Having a good skincare routine is also very important. You need to know what works on your skin well. You don't want to be buying X, Y, Z amount of products because someone on social media has said that it's really good. You have to know your skin type. What is your skin type? Is it dry? Is it oily? Is it combination? Is it normal? You need to take the time to undertake research on your skin. Speak to a professional dermatologist. Go and visit your local GP. Speak to someone in the medical field. Do your research. Don't wait and assume that this product that everyone is using is gonna work because that's exactly what happened to me in university. And I tell you, I broke out. I'll link my previous video in the description bar below of my skin being ridiculously spotty relative to my skin being very clear now. I would cover up my blackheads and my spots with foundation or concealer, but it just made it worse. Having flawless skin when you have makeup is amazing. Ah, oh, I'm gonna link a picture right now to show you how beautiful it is to have makeup and flawless skin. Flawless, beautiful orange dress, stunning necklace. As you can see, around that time, I had to really nurture and improve my mental state in order to see changes in my skin. If I kept eating junk food and I didn't do my exercise and I wasn't praying and being consistent in my skincare routine, I probably would have broken out even more. And I know skincare is very important because we need to nurture it. And I'm gonna do an updated skincare routine very soon so I can show you the products that I'm using at this moment in time. Please adopt a consistent skincare routine, not just for the summer, but in every area of your life. When you feel good internally, it shows externally. And you want people to see that you are glowing in a good way to encourage and inspire them. You don't just glow for yourself, you glow for other people to also glow as well. Your skin is there to show forth your beauty, to show off what God has created, but you have a responsibility to look after your skin by yourself. You're not waiting for people to tell you what to do. You are taking the initiative and being accountable for your own skin care routine. The importance of having good skin care is for the benefit of yourself. You will feel so good when you have clear skin.
For those of you who have oily skin, endeavour to try your best to cut down on oily food as well. Video still recording, looking great. I'm sorry. No, no, it's great. Hi guys, sorry to disturb. Oh no, no, it's okay. Sorry guys. Yeah, yeah. Subscribe to my sister's channel and buy her books as well. Authentic Word is on the map. Thank you guys so much. Stay tuned. Love you guys. <laughs> Bye. The more junk food you're eating, the more you are accumulating oil, which therefore produces spots. Drinking lots of water is also very important as well. Never underestimate its essence. I'll link all my videos about skincare in the description bar below. And I want you to really take the time to listen to all I'm saying in terms of the products that I've been using from time to time, my changes, and even recently the steamer that I currently use at the moment on a weekly basis. Doing a steamer every week opens up your pores and cleans the oil and cleans the dirt. And then afterwards you can put a mask on of your choice and do a 10 minute facial. You can also make your own mask with Greek yogurt, turmeric, oats and honey as well. Keep to a consistent skincare routine. If you keep changing products from time to time, that's where you break out and you're constantly thinking about what is working, what isn't working. You won't even know what's working for you because you're using countless products at once. So really take the time to focus on one product at a time. If you want to use a brand, let's say Garnier, Pixie, Simple, let it all be from that range. So get a whole range of Garnier, for example, or get a whole range of Pixie. Some people it works on, some people it doesn't. For myself, I used to use a whole brand of Garnier, but now I'm mixing it. Some people, they say use 10, use 20, but it just depends on the nature of your skin. Some people, they have to use so many products because depending on the depth of their skin and what they're going through, perhaps that is what they've been recommended. But other people, they can use just three and they're simply okay. It really does depend on the research that you're doing. So don't think that because this person is using 10, you also need to buy 10, because those 10 may not work for you. Be very careful with what you put on your skin as well. Every skincare product carries different chemicals. So you need to make sure that the chemicals work well on your skin. Ultimately, work on your inner being. There's power in being able to work on your character. Work on your self-development. Work on your weaknesses. Improve your strengths. Be a better communicator with other people. And love. Love and kindness are the two great secrets of good skin. But in my next video, I will be talking about my updated skincare routine as well. Do not forget to subscribe and also click the notifications bell for videos like these as well. Thanks very much for watching the video and I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you in the next video. Bye.